The dog waits for the white bride. He pants blood into his dog cock, kneeling in the bride's wake, her cunt thoughts reaching the dog as he pumps the last drop of blood into his red dog cock. The transmitted picture of the bride's cunt looms before the dog, finding still more blood to pump into his dog cock. The bride walks the streets, watching her own cunt projected on the sky. How clear in the midday sun. The dog's cock, now bigger from pumping blood, pumps over the next rooftop, creeping towards the projection. Dog wants bride cunt. His cock blocking out the sun's light and causing an eclipse. In the dark, the bride climbs onto the pumping cock, the heat in her cunt projecting her towards the knob, now nearing the bride illuminated skies and cunts. One in the sky, one on her. The cock is too fast. She can't climb at a fast enough rate. The dog, now nearing the sky, cunt waits. The bride wants dog. She climbs now onto the red cock tip and brides her cunt onto it. The dog pants. Seeing the bride's projected cunt in the sky and feeling the bride's own cunt on his dog cock, red as it is. Bursting with blood, still being warmed by the bride cunt. She wants dog. Dog wants bride. The red dog cock pumps sperm into the dark sky, lighting the way briefly for the bride, ramming her cunt onto the huge dog cock and saving some juice. She can have dog juice. Bride wants dog. The dog's still panting in the streets. The sun is back. The bride goes to her bride's secret dog thought. Dog love. Let me be your bulldog. Let me be your sheepdog. Let me be your hound dog. Let me be your dirty dog. Dirty dog. Let me tell you. Bow wow. Let me tell you. Girol. Let me tell you. Yap yap yap. Let me tell you. Snap snap snap. Snap snap snap. Let me catch you. Rabbits, let me catch you, hares, and all you want, all you want. It's just doggy love. It's just doggy love. Oh, doggy love. Oh. Doggy love. <laughs> the little jars filled with dog spermae vitae, like little pre frogs eating their own eggs in an attempt to become immortal. This frog like attribute unknown to lower dogs, but the cleverer sort can shield himself from such cunt thoughts. The bride always beaming through. Even a clever dog is powerless against the bride. She can make more dogs from the sperma. The little jars filled with dog sperma vitae 
like little dogs waiting to become immortal and pump blood into the dog cock as the bride wishes at her wish powerless the bride has the sperma multi dogs and can have dog whenever she wants the little jars filled with dog sperma Dear sir, I would like to inform you that I have cut off your dog's head, beheaded. I can assure you that the process was quite a painless. I used my self-developed dog guillotine and can guarantee for its efficiency the immaculate craftsmanship involved in its construction, its long life blade, its massive ten-ton weights. I have already disposed of the dog's body, but still have the head in the bowl. If you are in agreement, I could send you three powdered teeth as a token of condolence. <laughs> One of the dogs had his cock stuck in a hand cunt. He couldn't let go. It was a cock and stuck hand cunt. The next dog had his cock in her claw ear, fucking her eardrum. She could hear his cock, a thin dog cock juice hitting her eardrum. Another dog was fucking her eye. Another dog was fucking her nose. Another dog was fucking her finger, thumb. Another dog was fucking her elbow. Another dog was fucking her toes. Another dog was fucking her backbone. Another dog was fucking her asshole. Another dog was fucking her mouth. Another dog was fucking her cunt. Another dog was fucking she. Another dog was fucking she. Another dog was fucking her hip. Another dog was fucking her knee. Another dog was fucking her hand. Another dog was fucking her e. Another dog was e e o p o p o. And still there was time. <laughs>